We're so glad you joined us here at Riverview Virtual Campus. And moms, again, we hope that you have a wonderful Mother's Day and that you enjoy the time you have with whoever you're around. I've got a little scripture I'd like to share with you here in closing. It comes out of Romans 5, verses 1 through 5. Therefore, since we have been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Through him, we have also obtained access by faith into his grace in which we stand. And we rejoice in the hope of glory of God. Not only that, but we rejoice in our suffering, knowing that suffering produces endurance and endurance produces character and character produces hope. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. I don't know about you guys, but the last several weeks under the stay-at-home order have affected me and have been different than I thought they would be. Some of it has been good, some of it has been bad, and some of it I don't really know what to think about. But nonetheless, it has been different. In Romans, it tells us that through our faith in Christ, we obtain peace and hope. And it is in that hope that we are able to rejoice in the hard things and that we are able to enjoy the good things. But as we think about the hard things, it's that hope that brings about endurance through hard times. And endurance leads to character. And the Bible tells us that that character leads again to hope. So this week, I just want to challenge you and myself to live by faith in Christ this week so that we can enjoy and savor the good times as well as allowing the trying times to produce endurance and character and a deeper, stronger hope. Pray with me, would you? Heavenly Father, Lord God, we come to you and we thank you so much. Lord, that you are here with us through every situation, through every time. And Lord, we thank you that through you we can enjoy life, we can savor life, and Lord, we can press on through life. Lord, I just pray that this week, um, today especially, that you'd give the mothers an incredible day and that you would just bless them. Lord, we pray that you would just be with all of us this week and Lord, that you would help us to keep our eyes on you that you would help us to live our life by faith, our faith in Jesus Christ. And Lord, that as we go, when we hit trying times, Lord, that you would build that endurance and that character and that stronger hope inside of us. Lord, we just thank you so much that you never leave us. Thank you for who you are. It's in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Thank you, and you guys have a great week. God bless you.